Hello all, this is Tarun. Uh, today I am going to show you the simple Python script which I have made for this uh, postage stamp node. Uh, okay, uh, I am just importing this uh, input footage. I am leaving this. I am switching back to search view. Okay. Okay. While working, uh, you have to use this uh, same print node in your node tree, right? So usually what you do is, you will copy this print node and you will paste here and you will paste here uh, and you are starting working here and you will paste here and you will start working here right see when you are using the read notes for many times it will slow down your script i mean uh, it will slow down your nuke so what you can do is uh, simply you can create a postage stamp node so now you can uh, now you can connect this uh, input pipe of uh, postage stamp to this uh, read node right like this and also you can use this for uh, every time uh, I'm using the postage stamp here, here, so you can connect this uh, input like this, right? I'm building the uh, rest of the nodes. You can use the input footage here using the postage stamp, uh, and you can start working uh, over here, right? And also here, and also here. This input pipe for uh, postage stamp is uh, quite a bit annoying, right? So you can, uh, so you can hide this uh, input pipe. You can uh, switch. You can switch on hide input for everyone for every post system nodes. When you click on post system, it will show you the pipe. It will show you the input pipe. Uh, when you when you unselected that node, it will uh, hide that um, input pipe. Okay. So now I'm deleting all these uh, post system nodes. So now what I did in the Python script is. See, I have to create a um, I have to create a postage stamp node here. Okay. See, I'm clicking here in the node group and I'm just clicking this icon here. Now, what happened is at once when I have clicked this icon, uh, it's automatically created this uh, postage stamp node, and also it's automatically connected to the read node, and also it's automatically hidden the input pipe. Right? See, it's automatically switched on this uh, hide input option here. Right? The one more thing I did here is um, this icon. After you click this icon, uh, this will connect only to the uh, read nodes named as read one. Okay. See, I will show you the example. I am creating this. See, I am I am duplicating this uh, read nodes for thrice. See, this is read one. This is read two. Read three. Read four. Okay. I am see. I am clicking. I am clicking here in the node graph and I am clicking this icon. See, it will connect only to the read one node. It will not connect to these read nodes. For the most part, in your project, you will use uh, only one read node um, again and again, right? For that, I am using read one node. The reason I have uh, given only the read one is mostly you will use only the input footage again and again. The first in the first read node uh, you will input in the node graph is your uh, input footage, right? So the first read node is uh, read one. That's why I have. Um, that's why I have. That's why I have made a script for the postage stamp. Can you able to uh, connect only to the read one node? Okay. And also I have these two icons here. Uh, this is a shuffle node. Actually, uh, this is uh, greatly helpful for while you are using uh, while you are while you are uh, using uh, green screen keying. Uh, this will shuffle only the uh, alpha. See, I am connecting. See, uh, for example, I am connecting this to rotor node. See, uh, I have I have drawn this shape. Uh, in RGB, in RGB, it shows uh, nothing. Uh, in alpha, it's showing this uh, alpha, right? When I connect it to this, uh, it will show alpha in both uh, RGB as well as in alpha. Okay, this will uh, greatly helpful in uh, keying tasks. So that's why I have made this uh, icon over here, and also, and also this icon with the symbol P. Actually, I have made this uh, only for my testing purpose for my Python scripts. Whenever I have made a script, uh, I have to test the script by rendering, right? Uh, so for that purpose, I have made this uh, made this uh, tool. Uh, simply, it will create a, it will create you a checkerboard. Then. See, oh, I mean uh, alpha. Simply, uh, it will create you a checkerboard. Then it will be, it will create you a grade node, and it will 
um, give some color for the create node oh it's in a post-it stamp that's why it's showing like uh, that's why it's showing uh, thumbnail and also I have created this uh, right node uh, it will by default it will render this uh, image to my desktop so these are the tools which I am using for my daily tasks uh, so this is my um, render multiple right nodes uh, tool so it's now under development and also I am planning to add uh, more future for this once I have made that uh, I will make a separate video for that um, Okay, uh, that's all. Uh, these are the scripts I am using for my daily tasks. Thanks for watching.